Hello boys and girls, welcome to Peek Over My Shoulder in Wasteland 2, the Rector's Cult. We are in the prison map and I can hear chicken, also pigs. And right now we are uncovering this new area and I'm, I'm sending uh, Walking One with her perception view ahead to scout for mines and such. And, uh, Tinkering follows because he's the one who doesn't trigger ambushes as easily and, and if she detects any mines then then he can disarm them. Ah! Haha! -ha, I knew it! Oh, hello! I didn't record, did I? So, hello boys and girls, we're gathered here in the prison map in Wasteland 2, Director's Cot. And uh, and basically, we uh, we came up, we came through a scorpion's outpost, kept going uphill, heard chicken, heard pigs, I can see some farmhands over here, and I sent uh, I sent walking one and tinkering up to scout because she has higher perception and she was detecting all the mines which he was then disarming and now I'm I'm keeping an eye on what might be up here and right now I might actually send him ahead because he has the light step and uh, and uh, invisible presence or whatever so that he doesn't he doesn't uh, trigger ambushes or he doesn't uh, trigger encounters as easily as the others. Of course, if there are still mines, I want her to. Oh, hello! We even have a warning sign. What's this? A bird. Yeah, let's let's keep scouting. Also, the idea is that if there's an outpost here, then for now we're gonna ignore it. Ah, uh, I can see gate. So I'm guessing this is leading to the prison proper buildings. Okay. I think we might want to leave this for later then. But I am going to reveal those mines. Okay, this road is impossible. Okay, you catch up, but carefully. Hello. No, don't don't pick up anything. Let's watch out for the mines. Also, let's watch out for this area here. I'm guessing there's a minefield between the fences. Oh! <gasps> Robots! Okay, so where are those mines? Right, take all. Show me. Where are these mangoes? One more step, Rangers. Take <gasps> just one more step. Oh shit. Okay. Um Disregard. <laughs> right. We're gonna we're gonna return here later then. 
for now. She comes down there, so will he. And let's examine that farm. No, no, don't, don't just walk in there. I want to examine shit first. I suspect that there will be pigs in there. Okay, uh, let's let's bring the squad up here as well. again. Okay, what's happening on this side? Water. There's one farmhand, there's another person somewhere here. I can hear pigs. And there's a gate. Everybody gather somewhere here. Now you go ahead, keep scouting. I bet they have put some landmines uh, in here as well. Again, that's what I would do, doodly. Also, maybe they have buried something here. shit again. <gasps> awesome! Yeah, I like when the explosives come in ready-made form. I mean, ready-made form, ready for picking. Do we have here a safe? Something over there, some sort of vent or shaft. Okay, punching, get over here. Take the skate down for me, please. Awesome, thank you. Now, I wonder what happens if we talk to the farmhand? Will bad things happen and everything go on alert or, or what? Oh, 
so I can I can definitely hear the pigs. They must be close. They might be in here, maybe. If they're mines, please reveal them. Okay, there's a fire barrel. Crate. Okay, he might be up for talking. Doggy! Somehow I don't think that the locals are just gonna let us uh, wander around willy-nilly, so that's why I prefer some sneaking. Where's the foreman now? Field hand. Okay, another field hand. Serial dog. Safe, yes. Beehives. Punching. Get over here. Follow me. We are being very in inconspicuous. Okay, there's somebody somebody there. While the foreman is looking away, break this down. And now uh, get back here. Manual save. There are those piggies. Okay, you move over here. Oh, yeah. Are there any more fences? Now keep an eye on the foreman. Get past here. Uh, ooh, ooh. Okay, easy now. Uh, somehow I think we might need somebody with squee. So now you're just gonna run. Okay, you stand by with some. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, so. If we want to talk to them, we need to talk to them first. Right, uh, let me reload first. Okay, so we are back at this point. Everybody else is still... Didn't we break down this, this gate already? Now, I don't know what happens if we... If we uh, talk to the guys, so... Let's get these... These two into position. Also, I think uh, we can't just break down the uh, break down the fence. We have to woo the piggies first. Uh, let me check this area. Okay, so. Can't actually get past this point. Right, so the pigs can't just run because if they run, then they will alert the farmhands. And we can't get to this side now, at least. Let's see. So 
So basically, they don't like when uh, when the pigs get away. Uh, let's let's try talking. Oh. Okay. So the field field hands are hungry. What about you? Okay. Let's do a little recon here. So there is another gate here. here. Oh, hello. Right. So there's a shitload of stuff here. What about this guy? He seems some sort of head honcho. I don't think the field hands are totally hostile towards us. Like if they are hungry and would rather be doing something else. Hello. We're totally homesteaders. Uh -huh. <laughs> I should be reading this in an old grandpa voice. So basically, if you want to make a a, a uh, piggy breakout, then it would be better done covertly. Also, we probably shouldn't uh, uh, shouldn't crack any safes publicly. Too cool. So the field hands, uh, field hands, I understand, are the are the the farmers who didn't make it, or like the farmers who have been forced into into labor, basically. Whoa! Are we over encumbered yet? <gasps> What's this? Looks cool. Okay, so mm. let me check everybody. Doggy.
<laughs> Praise the militia. Okay. Yeah, I, I think we're not going to. We're not going to uh, do all the safe cracking right now. But now my thinking is, how do we get those pigs away from here in such a way that uh, that we don't get uh, into fight over them, at least not right away. Hello. Oh yeah, so we should be able to avoid the piggies before we head out. Except all the exits are... <gasps> Chicken! All the exits are actually covered by them. Which tells me... Oh, hello! Well, what a fine coincidence. I was just forming a plan that uh, before we address anything here, it's probably better to address uh, stuff at the prison. So before we before we do anything before we do anything with anybody and before we liberate any piggies we should uh, we should address the actual actual uh, root of the problem His name was who, whom uh, we have been avoiding at the at the front gates. And you'll save here. All 
also it would seem that before we do anything much we need to uh, we need to get some supplies because I don't think we have enough uh, medical stuff so it might actually be a good idea to uh, go by the citadel and uh, and sell some of this uh, stuff and uh, and uh, and buy medical supplies. Also, we probably want to uh, want to avoid. Uh, oh no, 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 go over there. We we probably still want to avoid the guy who greets us by the gates and uh, and uh, and wants some sort of uh, entry tax or or whatever. Yeah, let's let's go over there. Again, we have cleared this area, and where do we want to go now? Here. Yeah, I still want to avoid that guy, just to measure. So let us let us keep moving by the back paths. But also, I'm gonna step by the local farm and uh, and grab some peak shit. to converse with the local trader let's see because right now I think I have enough uh, resource that I can buy their fake money or whatever so. but also by by now we have killed so many uh, scorpions that we might not be uh, not even marginally welcome anymore Hello? Oh! He doesn't want to sell us anything anymore. I have an idea. I want to see what... Where was I? Uh, perhaps keeps uh, cutting off the recording at random times for some reason. Right, I wanted to see what happens if we try and go talk to this this person and also I wanted to check what his name was Danforth so what's your name? Van Overbake <laughs> I think he has more men with him. Or let's, let's go try speak. speak to <laughs> Spincher. I'm sure you understand that the upkeep on a beauty spot like this doesn't come cheap. <laughs> Taxes are how we collect the money necessary to make Happy Valley a safer, more attractive community for all. I hope you will pay yours without complaint. Do you now? Actually, I intend to pay him off at first, uh, just to see what happens. That scofflaw! 
She was crying outside the RSM General Store because she hadn't brought enough script to buy any food. And when we caught her, she couldn't pay her tranquility disturbance tax either. <laughs> I feel for her truly, but <laughs> the law is the law. Her husband should have taught her better. Gary Niger calls himself the River. Thinks him and Gladys should get special treatment because we buy armor from him. But this is a democracy. <laughs> no one's above the law. <laughs> Wait, is this the lady who, who refuses to die? But also refuses to live. <laughs> the best stock merchant in the wastes. The RSM is committing to making sure the residents of Happy Valley always have access to the finer things. Do you know? Formerly known as Ranger Headquarters, and before that, the Arizona State Maximum Security Prison. But now, transformed by the forward-thinking, civic-minded visionaries at RSM Enterprises, Inc. into a lush, peaceful, patrolled community for the discerning homestead who wants to escape the harsh conditions and uncertainties of the waste. Whee! Well, I admit it's in transition, but if you'd like to see an example of our vision for all of Happy Valley, visit Jim Alwater's farm. Soon everything you see here will look like that. Oh, really? We found that people had a negative reaction to the name Red Scorpion <laughs> Militia, so we streamlined it. Did you know? It's my job to assess taxes owed by residents and visitors to our town. It is Chaos's job to collect them. Is it now? Let's pay. Thank you, Rangers. We appreciate your cooperation. Let's go, boys. We're done here. Oh, this means we can... Uh... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. <laughs> this means we can just fight everybody in the same His place. His shoes are shiny. <laughs> I've never seen shiny shoes before. <laughs> Okay, this means we can now move more freely around the map. But this also means... This also means we still have to go by the headquarters because we don't have... This do that here. recorded message is brought to you by... RSM Enterprises Inc. This is Commander Dan Forth of the Red Scorpion Militia. You're about to trespass on Red Scorpion territory. Turn around immediately. Trespassers will be shot and fed to my dogs. Desert Rangers will be fed to my dogs alive. Are you quite done? Uh, but if you are instead a potential home center or interested in viewing one of our attractive farming lots, at the RSM Enterprises rental office, securely located just inside the prison. Thank you. Thank you. Because if uh, if encountering these guys didn't actually change anything, then I'm going to postpone it after all. Where's the trader here? Hello. Oh, I think we have already.
talked to him and he has explained everything and we have probably refused something and now he doesn't tell us anything else. Right, if that's the case then... Uh, then nope, we are not gonna carry on after talking to him, I'm gonna reload. Okay, so we are back at this point. We are not going to talk to the trader and we are not going to uh, talk to the slick guy in suit because my idea is actually <laughs> my idea is actually to go and uh, and handle the prison proper mm. uh, prison proper before we even acknowledge that guy that's how I roll working on it. Now... How can you starve on a farm? Things are very wrong here. <laughs> the things I won't do for explosives. the well out here. Okay. So, onward to the citadel. where again I don't want to go after any robots right now I want to I want to see a proper doctor and I want to I want to hand in some pig shit and and buy medical supplies I'm not gonna bother Also, I think we're uh, we're low on sniper ammo. Keep moving. Also, I have no idea where that place is supposed to be, where... Oh, he means the antenna over there. Okay then. I mean, I, I had plans to go there anyway, but... Yes. Alright, back at the base. 
I'm going to put some stuff away and, and resupply and then I'm gonna check out oh yes um, why don't we hear audio Responding. Uh, let's go in. Oh. going to stop recording but I want to know what's happening okay he's here then why is he not responding back again recruits what can I help you with apparently nothing all right good luck out there you'll be hearing from us what the Shitake welcome back farm has been Rangers I've been trying for years Thank to end the feud between the Topekans and the Atchison and honestly, I pretty much abandoned all hope. Oh. But you did it. A bunch of new recruits, and you untied the goddamn Gordian knot. Congratulations, Team Echo. You brought peace to the world. I take my hat off to you. <laughs> we had done it the last time we talked to you. I guess the task completions come in with the slight delay. Make us proud, recruits. So if I talk to him again... Haven't heard any new reports of the Ag Center disease spreading. Looks like you got it all, recruits. Well done. Okay. Make us proud, recruits. Still here, recruits? What else do you want to know? Okay. Make us proud, recruits. So apparently... We have turned in every intel that we have right now. Yeah, so... Episode ends here. I want to resupply and and rest a little bit and uh, and uh, and dump uh, the doodad on the specialist. So, thank you very much for watching. Bye bye for now. And see you soon.